That Labrador Retriever puppy is so cute, you just can't resist him. One of America's perennial favorite breeds, Labs make great, loyal companions. They are smart and easy to train. They are also energetic and need space. Remember, that active, adorable puppy soon will be a very active, medium to large dog. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. This secret training technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. Labrador Retriever Size The American Kennel Club standard for Labrador Retrievers says an adult male lab's height at the withers must be between 22.5 and 24.5 inches. A female lab will stand between 21.5 and 23.5 inches. Dogs varying more than a half inch above or below the standard are disqualified from showing. An adult male Labrador Retriever weighs between 65 and 80 pounds, with the female weighing between 55 and 70 pounds. As hunting dogs, Labs needed a strong build with good muscling. The dog should never appear low and long or tall and leggy in outline, according to the AKC breed standard. Effect of early spaying or neutering. If you spay or neuter your lab considerably before the puppy reaches puberty at about 7 or 8 months, rather than after puberty and the development that accompanies it, the dog probably will grow taller than the standard, with lighter bone structure and narrower skull and chest. That's because the sex hormones testosterone and estrogen play important roles in development of the adult dog. A dog's growth plates close later if the dog is spayed or neutered early, so the dog stops growing later. Only intact males and females can show in AKC breed shows, and the standard is written and judged to assure perpetuation of the breed's desired characteristics. Your lab's exercise needs. Labrador retrievers are energetic, highly active dogs, requiring plenty of exercise. If you can't provide a lab with good training, long daily walks, and opportunities to run in a large field or secure yard or a dog park, maybe this isn't the breed for you. If you have the space and want a dog to train for work, sport or active companionship, it likely is. These dogs are intelligent and willing to work, which is why they are so often the breed of choice for the blind and disabled as well as for scent detection work of various kinds and, of course, for hunting and trials. An untrained lab can be a doggy disaster. He's big, high-spirited and needs to know his limits. Other factors. Although the coat is short, labs shed a lot as in, you'll have lab hair all over everything in your house. He's such a friendly, lovable goofball you won't mind a little extra vacuuming for the next 15 years, right? A lab probably isn't the best choice if you live in a small space. If you live in a small apartment and really want a lab, consider adopting an adult from the shelter. Labs calm down considerably in middle age, and you can see the adult dog and determine in advance whether he really is a fit for your household and lifestyle. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel, Little Paws Training, if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.